Farmers in Caithness are calling for urgent help to tackle ravens attacking newborn lambs. They're asking Scottish Natural Heritage to relax the rules on killing the birds. But bird lovers argue a change in licensing would lead to unrestricted killing of the ravens. Emma Murray reports. It's a busy time of year for Selena Swanson and her husband John. The shepherds are well into their lambing season at their farm near Holkirk in Caithness. But once they have safely delivered their lambs, they also have to deal with a deadly threat from above. This farmer's footage shows several ravens separating newborn lambs from mothers before they attack. The Swansons have lost 10 lambs this year alone. It's hard. You're getting lambs up, ready, strong enough, all living, happy, fill bellies, and then you put them out to a field and they're going and they're getting pegged. A petition which has gathered over 1,800 signatures is calling for a relaxation in the rules to deal with what they are saying is an upsurge in raven numbers. The general licence allows livestock farmers to kill certain birds to protect their animals. However, ravens aren't included in this, as recently they've suffered from low numbers. Farmers instead have to apply for a specific licence, which they say is impractical and doesn't allow them to fully deal with the problem. Now, a counter-petition with more than 3,000 signatures has sprung up. The RSPB say it could lead to a local extinction of ravens, which are a protected species. We feel quite strongly that adding raven to the general licence means that the killing of these birds that are only just recovering from decades of persecution would be unrestricted and unregulated. We do issue specific licences uh, and that demand is increasing year on year, so we're certainly aware of, of the growing problem uh, and also the fact that raven populations nationally are doing better than they have been. So we're not opposed to having the conversation. They will be starting a formal consultation later this year, but farmers say more urgent action is needed. As the lambing season draws to a close, Selena and John will be undertaking round-the-clock shifts to try and ensure the safety of their flock. Emma Murray, STV News, Holkirk.